I'm with Ian Gately, who's been at the litmus test, uh, listening to poetry and short talks about the research. Ian, tell me, what are you going to take away from this? What I'm going to take away from this is um, how close science and poetry really are. I mean, in the, one could say that one is exploring the very edge of what we know, often with, um, with ele electricity, with rays, with um, spectrometers, with um, instruments which measure what we can't feel. And at the same time, poets also look to do the same, but using, let's say, emotional instruments instead. So the one side tries to learn more about our nature that surrounds us. The other tries to learn a little more about how we think. And so whilst the two might appear to be at the opposite end of the spectrum, when they meet at events like that, I find it quite inspiring. So Ian, tell me, how is this going to affect your writing? Well, I'm working through the history of commuting right now. Um, and so a lot of the science which is here is going to impact on my book quite a lot at the end. But it's also helping me to focus on the way people think about modern technology as it's applied in the transport sector. Um, and it'll help me focus when I'm getting towards uh, the latter part of my book. And you think this is important for your writing? I think it's an excellent event and I've really enjoyed it. And I think it's given me some um, useful inspiration which helps that to be taken away with me. Ian, thank you very much. Oh, my pleasure.